Hello, good people. This is Jim Van Ness uh, from BoxOfficeProfits.com. You may know me as Van Ness JC from the former Traders Retreat.com. Um, I am live on a Periscope for the first time. Hello, Periscope. And I have a box of 2015 uh, Pro Debut Baseball from Tops. Uh, I'm simultaneously recording this on Periscope and my normal camera for YouTube. In case the Periscope thing doesn't work, so YouTubers, Tops Pro debut. Um, so let's go ahead and get this bad boy ripped. Um, it's a 24-pack box, it's eight cards a pack, so it's going to take a minute because there's, there's a lot in it. Um, each box is promised uh, two autographs, two relics. Uh, so we've got some hits in this box. Uh, so let's go ahead and get right to it. Uh, the, the cool thing about Pro Debut Baseball, this is a minor league set. Uh, so we're looking at all minor leaguers here in their minor league uniforms. Uh, so we'll go ahead, uh, Tanner right here. This is from the Dayton Dragons. Um, the beautiful thing about these pro debut cards, they are minor league cards, but they design them like the Topps flagship. Uh, so we'll go ahead and put one over here to the YouTubers. Uh, so they look like the flagship cards. So these minor leaguers are getting treated as though they are major leaguers. Andrew Applin, Miguel Sano, Alex Reyes. Uh, ben Klemesh, Adam Conley, Brandon Nimmo, David Dahl. Nothing uh, of note in here. There are uh, parallels, gold, orange, red, and black. There are base variation cards. Um, this is an entire base set. Oh, she flipped me around. Outstanding. Hey, how are you doing there? Okay. So, um, I am not going to sit here and read every name off of every card. What? My lovely wife is uh, handling the filming, um, and it's a good thing she's behind the camera. Because if she was in front of it, you would look at her and not look at the cards, and we don't want that. Um, it looks like we're going. Oh, so, so getting some hearts coming in. Uh, I'm not going to read every single name on every single card uh, because that would take us forever. Uh, what I am going to tell you is that uh, it's a couple of full-on base packs. Um, again, there are parallels in this set. There are a couple insert sets. Um, and hopefully we will see some of those here momentarily. Uh, Kyle Crick from Your Richmond Flying Squirrels. Who doesn't like the flying squirrels? Um, let's see. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. There's the big man. Byron Buxton, New Britain Rock Cats. The twins can't wait for this guy uh, to make it to the majors. Um, again, the beauty of these cards, they are high-quality cards. There's great photography. Uh, and they're the minor leaguers. So anybody living in these minor league cities... Um, these cards are great to take and get autographed because that, that's one thing about the minor leagues is these guys go out of their way for a uh, great fan experience. Uh, so they autograph like crazy. And it's just a way to get some um, some awesome looking cards of these uh, future stars of tomorrow. I can't tell you how many times I've gone back into my pro debut boxes uh, to find guys who I had never heard of at the time. And, you know, now all of a sudden they're Mike Trout they're, or, uh, you know, um, Chris Bryant. Here is our first uh, insert. It's a distinguished debut, Grant Holmes. Um, we'll put him up here for the Periscope folks. Kind of a shiny as a metallic looking card there. Um, Grant Holmes for the YouTube. Come on, focus in. There we go. Uh, there are 25 different distinguished debuts, and they also come in parallels that are numbered. But that one is not numbered, so it is just the base. Um, there is also a car, it's a set called Promo Night Uniforms. Uh, so we'll be getting to those momentarily, I'm sure. Uh, Leo Morban. Up, oh, another distinguished debut. This one, Tyler Kolek. This one's called Here Comes the Heat. Uh, and he is, let's see, who does he play for? Or he's a Marlins number one draft pick and uh, is playing for. Uh, da, 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 da. I can't find it on the card. And. Uh, all right, so we got that for the YouTubers. I'm down to one person actually watching the Periscope. I was hoping to get, uh, you know, double digits, but this is not the most exciting thing to watch uh, on a product like this because there's so many base cards. Um, there we go. Our first parallel, Sean Newcomb Orange. Uh, as you can see, it's the same as the base card, uh, but it is the orange border right there. The orange, uh, this is number 225, uh, so number 5 of 25, get the gold numbering on the back, 5 of 25, uh, so um, you can't beat the low numbered uh, parallels. There are gold in here, number to 50, 
orange number to 25, like we just saw, red number to 5, and then there's one of one blacks and one of one printing plates. Uh, Jake Stinnett. Ah, here's our first autograph. We'll get to that in a second. Okay, the first autograph of the box is Drew Vettelson from the Harrisburg Senators. Um, it is a sticker autograph, as you can see, pretty well centered. Uh, and you can actually almost read the name. At least you can read the Drew V part. Uh, let's get it focused in for the YouTubers. All right, it's not really focusing in. This is a base autograph. Again, Harrisburg Centers, Drew Vettelson. Uh, very nice looking autograph. Um, I know people aren't so thrilled with sticker autos, uh, but you know you can't get you, you can't get on card autos in every single set. Ah, here we go. Our next hit is a manufactured pennant patch. The uh, the Asheville Tourists, Ramel Tapia. That is a pennant patch. Uh, it looks like the hat patches have been replaced with these pennant patch. It's a nice thick stock card, as you can see. Um, real nice patch, the thick card. And the pennant for the, uh, the Asheville Tourists. Um, so that's a nice looking card, and that is one of the two relic hits we'll get in our box. Um, this is not a parallel, it is just the base. Um, another manufactured set, and this is one that the kids always love. Uh, it's a big one, is the mascot sets, mascot patches. Um, our next distinguished debut, Casey Gillespie. I'm out there. This is a nice looking card, I like the shininess, the background, the blue. Uh, just sets it apart from the base. Uh, no border as well. Uh, very nice, very nice looking cards. Um, we are about a third of the way through the break. And we'll just keep plowing through it and see what we got. Aaron Blair, Jackson, Hawkins, Peter O'Brien, the Mobile Bay Bears, Christian Arroyo from the Salem Kaiser Volcanoes. Um, you got to love some of the mascots of these minor league teams. So they're fantastic. Nestor Molina, because we don't have enough Molinas in the game of baseball right now. Um, Raul Mondesi Jr. Here is a Mike Pappy from the Mahoning Valley Scrappers. This is a gold parallel. You can see by the gold border. Uh, when I flip it over, it should be number 250. And it is numbered 8 out of 50. The gold numbering, when I'm not wearing my glasses, uh, sometimes makes it hard for me to see. And let's see the gold border there. And then the gold foil numbering on the back, 8 of 50. Uh, keep going. Try to pound these out. Um, again, there's the mascot manufactured patches. There's also actual relic sets, uh, fragments of the farm, that are actually game-used uh, jersey pieces. Uh, Miguel Amante, Lucas Sims. Another pack of base. Um, when it comes to uh, different inserts, different things, it's, there's really not a whole lot to tell in Pro Debut. It's a pretty straightforward set. It's a set collector set. It is a minor minor league collector set. Uh, the people who go out to the minor league games and see these guys play because uh, they don't live in a major league town, um, it, you know, that's what we're getting here. Um, again, we do have the autographs. We've got the relics. We've got a couple patches. Um, ultimately, that is... Uh, about all we have. Um, there is one other card to mention, and maybe I'll pull it and I can show you it. Uh, distinguished debut, Alex Vertigo. Put him up there. Looks like he is a Dodgers uh, farm player. Um, flip him around. The YouTubers. Uh, like I mentioned, there's one other card. It is a one card insert set. It is the Make Your Pro Debut winner from last year. Uh, every year they have the contest. There's a card to pull, and you sign a one-day contract uh, to play for one of these teams. Uh, in this case, it was a gentleman named Tyler Badger. Uh, so he will have uh, his card in this set. Uh, we got our next autograph. It is, again, a base auto. Uh, this is Robbie Hefflinger from the Mississippi Braves. Again, real nice signature, blue ink right in the middle of the sticker. Uh, looks real good. Again, we know people don't like the sticker autos, but uh, they're really, really nice looking cards. Robbie Hefflinger uh, in the Braves organization, the Mississippi Braves uh, in this case. So we've got one more hit to come up with in this box. 
uh, and it is going to be another relic. It could be a manufactured patch, or it could be a, uh, a game used relic. Um, we haven't come up on it yet. Uh, apparently, since they're so thick, there's only one or two cards in the pack with those, so we will find those. Uh, find it soon enough, I'm sure. For base here, Jake Bowers. As you can see at the bottom of the card, the colors change based on the color of the of the team. Uh, you know, so we got gray, blue, green, yellow. Um, now to do it. Um, here we go. More base. Matt and Hilfer, Grant Holmes, Austin Hedges, Waldrop, Lance McKillers, Phil Irvin, Dr. Harvey. Um, one thing that's a bummer is. Uh, not being in a minor league town, I've never heard of most of these guys. Uh, I'm in St. Louis, so I'm a Cardinal guy. I haven't even heard of most of the Cardinal fans in these boxes. Ah, here we go. Here's the promo night uniforms. Uh, it is Daniel Carbonell from the San Jose Giants. It's a black card. Let's get that on there. This one of the promo night uniform set. Uh, it's an insert set. I do believe they're one per box, so that is our one. Put it over here for the YouTubers to see. Nice looking card. Um, also mentioned as I'm winding down, a big thank you to Box Office Profits and Trader Retreat for getting this box to me. Uh, but more importantly, a big shout out to Tops for sending it to us to go ahead and review. Oh, and here is our next mascot, or our next patch card. It's a mascot. It is Splash Pelican. He is from uh, the Myrtle Beach Pelicans. So check out this Splash Pelican patch card. Nice, isn't it? Okay. Put it over here. Uh, essentially what it is is it's a picture put on a patch and then it's inserted into the card. Uh, it's it's a two-level kind of a deal. It's kind of indented there, indented on the inside. Really, really, really nice looking. Uh, and uh, like I said, the kids love the mascots. Um, but again, thank you to Tops, Traders for Treat, and Box Office Profits for getting these to me. I will be having a full written review up at Box Office Profits. I would figure that to come out early next week. Um as we finish this off. Um, what it will have is it will have all the information, all the different stats and everything else, as well as scans of all the cards. Uh, not all the cards, but scans of, of a good portion of the cards. So for anybody who wasn't able to get a good view on the Periscope or the YouTube, um, we will have something uh, in uh, online for you to check out. Oh, another promo night uniform. Looks like from the Charleston River Dogs. This is Greg Bird. And you can see this promo uniform. He's wearing the New York Yankees uniform. Uh, that's pretty cool. Put this one over here. Very nice looking card. Um, and it just kind of tells you a little bit on the back about him, uh, about how they got to wear their uh, their pro uniforms, even though they haven't quite made the pros yet. And the last pack of cards, just to wind it down. Again, this is a 24-pack box with eight cards per pack. So you're coming away with a little less than 192 cards because you lose some to the patches. One more parallel of Tyler Kolek from the GCL Marlins. And this is a gold. And uh, we flip it around and you can see that it's numbered to 50. I believe that's 45 of 50. Flip it over to here to 45 of 50. And the gold card on the front of the gold border. Again, it's just a typical parallel. It's the same as the base, but with a colored border. Um, one thing to mention before I go, this is a 200 card set. Oh, for Cardinal fans out there, Steven Piscotti, people have been crying for him to come up with all the injuries in the outfield. There he is in his Memphis Redbird uniform. Uh, so I know there's a lot of St. Louis, any St. Louis folks who are watching this are like, yeah, we could use him. Uh, but this is a 200 card base set. Uh, so we're not going to come away with quite the whole set because we're probably in the 180 card range. Uh, I don't recall seeing any duplicates, but I will let you know in the review, uh, or the written review. So I want to thank everybody on Periscope. Uh, thank anybody at YouTube. Again, Trader Retreat Tops, uh, Box Office Profits for sending it to me. Um, we'll have this up next week as a written review and uh, looking for more boxes in the future. So uh, everybody out there, thanks for watching. Uh, this is uh, Jim Van Ness signing off.